Hey guys, Angry Monkey here. Are we actually on D-Day? Are we on the Americans now? I, th I think maybe we're on the Americans now. I mean, this is D-Day, and we're in 1944. I mean, th this we're finally at the part where the Americans come in, which really excites me. We're finally out of Egypt, and we're we're back on just, I guess, regular, regular war, at least for us. I really like these, the, where it actually shows the real footage instead of just a slideshow, because I mean, it it really. It's more immersive, more of an experience of actually seeing the combat instead of just a slideshow, although those are really cool pictures too. But it's really cool to just see this old footage from the 40s, like actual war footage. I managed to pick up... Um, D-Day, uh, or not D, uh, I can't remember what it's called, Band of Brothers, I managed to pick that up, um, the other day, I've, I've seen it, but I saw that basically when it first came out, which was like 17 years ago, and I was like 8, um, yeah, it probably wasn't something for an 8 year old to watch, but I, I just remember that that really impacted me, just watching that whole experience there, um, I remember it was the sixth or seventh episode uh, where we were in uh, Battle of the Bulge and it was winter time and just our guys were getting slaughtered and I remember just looking, asking my dad, I said, how did we win this? Because I was just seeing just how we got destroyed. Anyway, we're playing as Americans. True American. I'm excited. So yeah, I can't believe that we only had one more episode as British, and then uh, when I think when I see the Rangers, I always think of Saving Private Ryan because they're um, they're the second Rangers too. If you guys haven't seen that movie, that one's a really good movie. Check it out. Eight guys, eight men, led by Tom Hanks, go on a mission to rescue Private Ryan because his three brothers have been killed. And it starts off with with this on this part of D-Day. Uh, did, did I... No, I didn't die yet. I don't have a stupid inspirational quote. Whoa, that guy's caught fire. Okay. This is actually part of the game. I I, uh, I didn't die as soon as I got off the boat. Although, unfortunately, a lot of men did on D-Day. Very sad that they didn't get a chance to contribute much to uh, help in the country. Now, I do remember reading about some uh, some war game that went horribly horribly wrong where some men died in just the training like they didn't even make it over to Europe and died I just can't imagine what what they were going through what their families were going through to think that that is how they gave their life was just in training okay there we go One of our guys. I don't see any other enemy. So I guess I'll just. Okay, where are they? 
Well, I'm getting shot at. Okay. Got him. I want to say this might be what the artwork for one my artwork and the the game cover is based off of. Is this level possibly? Yeah, I think I'm meant to be a sniper. Now, did my guy seriously come onto the beach with five bullets? Did he seriously think that was a good idea? Okay, maybe I'm ready. That's cool. Okay. Almost to the top. Okay, that's our guys. Whoa. That's high up. Okay, made it to this checkpoint. Okay, well, clearing out all these guys. Okay, so this part of the bunker is cleared out. So these guys won't bother us anymore. Oh, what? Huh? Where did he... <laughs> Future me replay that part. That was funny. He just he just blew himself up. Ooh. Oh yeah. We want anything other than this. Okay, you can die any time now. Okay. See, that's how you throw a grenade over a wall. Oh. Sorry, dude. It was 200 liters of something. Okay. Where does this lead to? Can I... I can't open that door. Okay. That's kind of lame.
I saw that coming. Oh, I'm back here. Okay, whatever. head off. This is brutal. Sorry guys, commentary is a little lacking right now. I'm uh, just... I'm trying to not die. I'm trying to not do a repeat of the of the last couple episodes, which I didn't know were the British finale. Didn't seem as climactic as um, the the finale for the Russians. Oh, okay. That's what I was getting shot at. Um, I don't know which way I'm supposed to go first. It doesn't matter. And I finally made it to that hole just to die. First part of this is pretty easy. I say that as I'm about to die. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, come on. Were there more guys here this time? Okay. I keep saying that uh, we're never going to be bothered by those guys again, but we will if I keep dying. Does this go anywhere? It basically goes to my death, I guess. Now, how does my guy already have German grenades if he just landed? And is who is shooting at me? Do you... Oh, well. 
Okay, smoke grenade it is. Okay. Uh, no, 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 no. I am stuck. Okay. That was easy. Can all the enemies go down that easily? He's still alive. Not anymore. Okay, can't go there. Of course, just a minefield there. Okay, I think if I wait here, I get another checkpoint. I'm gonna try going this, nope, can't go that way. One of the major reasons why we won in World War II was just from sheer number alone. Especially when it comes comes to our um, tanks and everything. Uh, some of our cheaper tanks, like the Stuarts, maybe the Shermans, they will, I mean, for every one they destroy, there's like four more that's going to take their place. And so we, we just pretty much, just, um, we pretty much won by numbers alone. We're not clear, he was still alive. Okay. These are the levels I like best when you're actually going through a town. Guess I can't climb over that. Should take down the downstairs first. Of course, there's grenades everywhere. Okay, checkpoint reached. Now, let's take up the upstairs. I 
wonder if wonder if that's anybody important it's really interesting to see all these beds in here you can tell that a lot of guys were camping out in this building Okay. okay. Panzer, really, already? And I'm not ready to deal with that. Okay. Oh, okay, so this, I guess this is it of this little town. This really is a little town. Okay, I'm supposed to go this way. Where am I supposed to go? Compass is pointing me to go the opposite of where I'm currently walking, but it's completely blocked off. And everybody here is just hanging out. I would love to cover you while you reload, but there's nobody to shoot at. Nobody to cover. There's So how do I get over there? Oh, this way? No? Seriously, I am stuck. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I'm not going to look up where to go on a Call of Duty game, the most linear game ever created. Well, um, I guess I'm supposed to call it an episode? I've been, I've been doing a really bad job of um, seeing on how long these episodes are. Uh, so I guess I'm going to stop it here and I'll come back in the next episode and hopefully figure out where I'm supposed to go and I will see you guys then.